what's up guys welcome to new tutorial uh, today I will show you uh, fast tutorial uh, new idea uh, a row 3d logo uh, pretty uh, very pretty logo uh, web uh, 2.0 let's start with arrows <coughs> let's choose one of them let's choose this drag and drop it drop it here ground it object and expand okay delete these points make it taller like this zoom I designed uh, with the, the same white with it here. Now select both of them and the thick pathfinder and choose a divide. Click here and drag it here like this. Select this part and uh, unit, make it unit like this now mm, what uh, no, let's make it a little small here thirty and thirty oh sorry 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 this let's delete this point here before we select the object and delete this and delete this select the point drag it 30 here and this the same 30 like this mm. we have problem here Let's do the, uh, this the job another time. Select rectangle tool. The same weight. Put it here. Let's make this point smaller than this. That's enough. Put it here. Select both of them, divide like this, select this side and make it a unit. I think uh, that's good. That's good. Now, select all this uh, symbol or row and uh, drag it to uh, symbols here. Okay, delete her, delete it from her. Now uh, go and uh, click Eclipse tool, put it here, rectangle tool in the middle, select both of them and go to Pathfinder and uh, uh, minus round. Now let's go to Effect 3D Revolve. Or um, I think that uh, if we use the rectangle, it's uh, good than uh, uh, rectangle and uh, eclipse. Uh, choose the rectangle tool, put it here, and go to effects 3D revolve. Preview, make it to a good angle, good view angle. Uh, let's try this map art invisible geometry and uh, go to our symbol there it is new symbol now put here in the third surface the surface go to new symbol put it here let's adjust it mm. okay there. 
let's choose a good rectangle or good look Let's go. Click OK. Click our object and uh, uh, go to Object, Expand Appearance, Delete this point. We don't need it. That's good. And zoom, make this with this a unit. OK. Select all our object. Let's choose a good color. I like this uh, blue, sky blue. Now choose uh, white. I I think that's a mistake here. Let's delete this point. Yes, uh, a hundred blue. Mm, no. Or blue for another uh, object like this. Now, now, like this. It's simple and a good logo. I adjust it and uh, let's before this click object and expand like this. And logo name logo make it bigger bold and italic characters uh, space between the letters. Gray. It's a simple logo, and it's uh, he have a, a, a pro look. You can you can modify it uh, as you like. There is uh, you can uh, this style is uh, uh, web 2.0 style. Uh, a simple color with uh, white gray white stock. Uh, and uh, you can uh, make uh, uh, the name of the logo with uh, a gray. It's uh, make a very very pro look to your logo. So guys, uh, thank you very much for watching. And uh, if you uh, like it, uh, uh, share it with your friends. Uh, and I'll see you later. Thank you.